this tutorial in PhotoDirector 365, we're going to show you how you can stitch a cluster of photos together into a single shot called Panorama. It will actually combine the photographs into a larger one. Let's show you how easy it is to use this particular tool. On the screen you see the first of nine shots I've taken of the same scene going from left to right and then top to bottom. So we have a pretty broad picture here, but it's composed of nine separate photographs. Let's see how easy this tool is to use. I'm going to click on the guided button at the very top and it will want to make a copy. Then I click on the photo merge subcategory on the left side and choose the second option called panorama. It gives me a source screen and a destination screen. So I'm going to click on any one of these, do control A to select all of the images and drag them up to the top. It's numbered them and it's going to intelligently put them together. I simply click on merge below the preview screen. And when it's done, it will have the suggested crop because the edges might not be identical. I can make it larger or smaller just by moving the handles on the side of the crop. And then I can also click on Auto Fill Boundary if I'd like to use that option. What that will do is that will fill, attempt to fill gaps between the images. I don't need it in this particular case, but I ran it just in case I needed it. And so this is my final image. I can crop it down if I want to again, but I don't need to. I'm going to click on Save As give it a name. I'm going to call it uh, Wide Shot and it will save it and add it to my library. So now I have a composite panoramic shot made out of, in this case, nine separate shots by using the simple panorama tool under the guided area in PhotoDirector 365.